Hello everyone, I'm Lajadi. Welcome back to Music Greatness. This is Ruben and for today we have Self Control by Frank Ocean. Sounds just like this. Alright, what I just played was the main riff that we're going to use for the first verse, the chorus and also the second verse in the song. We're playing in the key of A flat major here. And for this main riff, we only have four chords to learn. The first one being A flat major 7. Three notes in total. A flat on my left, playing G and C for my right hand. So I'm playing the root, major seventh, and major third. Going to the sixth chord, F minor, F on the left, again that's only one note, F, A flat, and C for the right. Then before going up on the following one, we're going to play one quick A, natural A on the left, and then go up and play B flat minor seven. B flat on the left, having F, A flat, and D flat for the right hand. So I'm playing the fifth of B flat, the seventh, and the minor third on top. And then, for the fourth and final chord in this main riff, we have E flat major, the fifth chord in the key of A flat. E flat played on the left, and we have G and B flat for the right. So that's all we have for this main riff. Recap A flat major 7. That's our first chord, then F minor, that's the second one, going up on B flat minor 7, that's the third, and then the fourth is E flat major. So. For the rhythm, we're going to stay on each chord for two measures. So two measures on A flat measure 7, two measures for F minor, two measures staying on B flat minor 7, and finally also two measures for E flat major. Here's the playing pattern. Two. Three, four. One, two, and three, four. One, two, and three, four. So the main pattern that we're going to use for that main riff is that we're going to play the left hand note on the first beat, and we're going to replay the notes we have on the right twice in the same measure. One, two, and more precisely, we're going to replay the notes on the right on the end of the second and also on the fourth beat. One, two, and three, four. 
So play the notes on your left, the bass, on the first beat, and we play the notes on the right, on the end of the second, and on the fourth. One, two, and three, four. So that's one measure. As I said, we have two measures for each chord, so we're going to repeat. A flat major seven. One, two, and three, four. I'm going to do the same for F minor and B flat minor seven. Two measures each. One, two, and three, four. One, two, and three, four. And one, two, and three, four. One, two, and three, four. So basically, I played the same pattern, but remember, we have one A played before landing on B flat minor seven, and we're going to play that note on the end of the fourth beat. Second measure, playing on F minor. One, two, and three, four. One, two, and three, four. Then for E flat, the last chord, we're going to play this. Two, three, four. One, two, and three, four. One, and two, and three, four. So two measures on E flat major. For the first measure, we're going to use the same pattern we had for A flat major 7, F minor, and B flat minor 7. 1, 2, and 3, 4. And then for the second measure, we have something a little bit more different. It goes like so. 3, 4. 1, and 2. So first thing we can notice is that we're going to play on both hands on the first beat. So first beat of the measure, I'm going to play E flat on my left and play G and B flat with a grace note going up on C. Third finger on B flat and pinky on C. So that's the grace note I'm going to play on the first beat. Three, four, one, and two, and three, four. So just after playing the grace note on the first beat, on the end of the first, on my right hand I'm going to go back to my regular position and play G and B flat. And then I'm going to replay those two notes on my right hand, G and B flat, on the end of the second. One, and two, and three, four. And also on the fourth beat. So once again. One, and two, and three, four. Now here's the two measures back to back for E flat. Three, four, one, two, and three, four. One, and two, and three, four. And that's the main riff. You only have to loop the entire pattern from A flat major seven going to E flat for the verse, chorus, and second verse. Here it is again, slow tempo. Two, three, four. One, two, and 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 three, four, and one, two, and three, four. One, two, and three, four. One, two, and three, four.
Okay, if you get the pattern down, let's recap and replay that at full speed. And that's all there is for this first part. For the rest of the song, head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. If you love the content, leave a like, leave a comment, and also don't forget to subscribe. Until then, see you guys next week for another Urban.